takes one hell of a sound. I got up at five o'clock this morning to come drive up a snowy mountain pass. And I'm really bad at getting up in mornings, but it was definitely worth it. So let's talk about the eye-watering <laughs> price. I've just found the information on this car. RS6 Avant Performance, 150,000 Swiss francs. That's standard. Then you've got the special matte uh, silver paint on this car, another 7,500. This model uh, in particular with the seats and the, all the Alcantara and all these little things, um, adds up to 193,000. Now that's not even including the exhaust on this car. This one in particular has a uh, Akropovich um, catback exhaust and that is 9,700 on top of the 193,000. And this one also has, I'm not exactly sure how you say that, ABT or apt um, tuning. So this pushes the power up to 705 PS. I was told in sport mode, it's just over uh, 900 newton meters of torque, which is just absolutely madness. So then that again, on top of everything, is 11,590 francs on top of everything else. So yeah, that's enough to um, put you back in your seat a bit. I mean, this car is just incredible. Don't get me wrong, it's really incredible, but that's supercar money. But I guess the point is, you can drive this like a supercar, but you can use it all year round. So I do understand why it does cost so much. This morning, um, it was at half a tank, and I put another 25 francs in, because I didn't want a full tank, I didn't want it to be maximum weight for driving around uh, Mountain Pass. And I put 25 francs in, but it still stayed at half a tank. I think I literally put 25 francs in and it just went hum, gone. My only complaints are uh, the paddles. The paddles are made of plastic in a 200 grand car. If you're a passionate driver like me, 90% of the time you've got it in manual. So your hands are always touching these and Part of the Audi feeling is everything you touch does feel nice. So this for me feels horrible, it feels so cheap and the sound is horrible. I just don't understand why they would put plastic paddles in a 200 grand car. Otherwise the drinks holder is in a bit of an awkward place because they're right here right in front of the armrest so it rubs against the armrest and 
you can't put your arm here anymore if your drinks are there.